A warmest hello to everyone. Hope everyone is safe, secured and healthy. Today's topic of talk is video resume. What video resume is? Video resume is a short video created by a candidate for employment and uploaded to the internet over YouTube, LinkedIn or the professional business sites like Vimo and Vista. It can be emailed to the hiring managers. But, but remember, it is not a substitute to the print resume. Why do we need them? Do we really know that 60,000 of the video files are viewed more than any other files? Do we know that 10% only we remember when we listen? Do we know that 20% only we remember when we read? 80% when we do and see? There is one employer survey also wherein it was told that 89% of the employers are interested in viewing the video resume wherein only 17% are able to do it. That makes it sure that there is a need of it. And once you prepare them, it's very important for the students who are preparing for the placement. Why? Because there are three important questions also get prepared once you prepare your video resume. Question number one, tell me about yourself or introduce yourself. Question number two, why should I hire you? Question number three, describe your CV in five lines or eight lines or scan me through your CV. These kind of questions can easily be handled as they get rehearsed and practiced. Now, what does an employer look through it? I ask you two questions. When we see a trailer of a movie, what do we expect of a movie? And when we play on a video game based on virtual reality, what do we experience? The answer is the same. Whatever the employer wishes to see when he, whatever the employer wishes to see when he sees your video resume. Now, the question is not only this, whatever he wishes to see, of course, whatever he wants to test, whatever he wants to assess, he can make it out from that resume. There are various important areas to be covered. This works as, a, it acts like a pre-interview. It's a kind of, a, a, you know, a bridge between the recruitment application and the actual interview. It showcases your personality. It shows your uh, shows the demeanor of the candidate and the professional presentation of the candidate. It ensures the visibility, of course, over social media. It also showcases your tech savviness and very important, the selling ability of the person and the profiles like customer service wherein the person really wants to test those areas. I'm sorry to say that when you're not able to convince or to sell yourself, you cannot sell their products or services as well. So these are some of the areas wherein the employer is interested to look through. Now, how to go about it? A small formula I would like to share with you. The A, B, C, D, E, F of it. A, that stands for attire or appearance. That has to be formal. That means as you dress up for the interviews. B, the background that has to be plain. It could be creative, but the only point, it depends on the profile which you're applying for. We are engineers, we don't need it anymore. C, communication. Most important, content, creativity, and call to action. When it comes to communication, these verbal and non-verbal areas have to be taken care of. Verbal, that means the clarity, conciseness, and the clarity has to be maintained. And then the communication has to be convincing. Non-verbal communication, of course, you need to maintain an eye contact with the camera. And of course, a positive and professional body language. Content, as I've told you, it has to be concise. That is, it should not exceed 90 seconds. It should be between 60 seconds to 90 seconds. 
the conciseness has to be taken care of plus along with creativity as i've told you creativity has to be in terms of content as well as technical aspects call to action it cannot be complete the video resume are not complete unless they are backed by call to action that means we are concluding your resume by your email id or your contact number or linkedin id or your website you need to conclude because in the end you need to say that you have to contact over these then important that is d that is dynamic personality has to be showcased e eloquence whatever you are speaking it has to be spoken with eloquence the right tone with the right sharpness with the right intonation diction pronunciation of the words they are very important to be taken care of now the eloquence that has to be maintained with energy and enthusiasm and if i'm showing my energy and enthusiasm that shows that i am going to put my energy also in the work e another e that is external aspect that is the lighting quality and the video quality please make sure two of them f the feedback to have the final product feedback from the faculty feedback from the family or your friends once you are preparing your final product now remember to get yourself prepared for your video resume there are three p's important one is prepare second is practice third is present when you are preparing what do we need to be prepare the content that you are going to deliver that has to be prepared in advance it has to be scripted make sure it is a scripted one but it it should not be sounded like a robotic one right and it should be sounding natural right once you cram also but it should sound natural and once you're preparing the content the question arises what do i need to include into it you can include your education your experience that is there are your projects your skill summary your personality traits your personal skills or personal characteristics your career objective your accomplishments and of course your technical competencies these are all required to be included and you can add the flair of creativity to make it to, to make them more creative because they make you stand out so please try to be creative as possible as creative as possible you can in, uh, begin with adjectives you can uh, begin with your passion you can begin with your career objective you can end with your aspirations the way you want to continue with it so please prepare your content then present pre practice and present then the three important hours to be taken care of when you are collecting the feedback from your faculty friends and fr uh, family members you can rehearse retake and record please do remember that you need to prepare your winning video cvs to win your employers please seek help of the references we are providing to you there could be various of them like uh, the the career balance.com the you uh, this the i would just like to share the beyond.com the joinforce.com the sparkhire.com and byzo.com all of them we are sharing on your email ids and then uh, there are some content also some preparatory material to support so that you can prepare the best of the resumes and i wish you all the best for your presentation preparation and placement Thank you so much. Take care. Stay healthy. Stay happy. Stay home.